brekkie time. I'm very tired. <laughs> We're going to get us some nice breakfast. It's freezing, I'm showing this window. Oh, where's the food then? In there. Off we go then. <laughs> Just got off the bus, this one. Um, we're going to the Vatican City. We almost stayed on the bus, <laughs> but <laughs> we got off it at the right time. I think that's some sort of castle. It's on my map, but I don't know what it's called. <laughs> Just a short <laughs> walk down the road and we are here at the Vatican City. Just a little heads up if you come here, <laughs> you will be harassed by every single person that you walk by to get tickets or skip the line or whatever. But it, just learn book the your, word, no thank you. Yeah. Book your tickets online. <laughs> just book your tickets online and you walk past all of them. I think this is where we've got to go. Yeah. warm in here. Security time. <laughs> Finally got in. It was quite a trek on it. Hi. Yeah. And we're in into the gardens and that is St. Peter's Basilica. We just walked down some steps that were in the middle of the garden and we found this little um, museum place and it has this giant sculpture of a horse and carriage which is amazing <laughs> cars look like something out of titanic <laughs> it's a pope mobile Me and Mum are both getting a glass of Prosecco and we're just sat in this little courtyard area. We've just ordered two glasses of Prosecco and a beer. I want my beer. <laughs> and they always bring out little yeah, crisps for us. Yeah, they have to feed you, us. remember? Cheers. Yeah. Charles. Charles. That's the happiness exit ever. <laughs> we have walked back round to the Peter's Basilica, a little square bit. The queue to get into it is quite long. About an hour. <laughs> All the way around here. <laughs> it's free to get into though, so we might do it. But it looks really cool. We decided to join the queue, but it's really not. Oh, it's all the way around there. We joined it at about here. 
and it's been about 10 minutes and we're already like halfway so it's really not that bad. Another 10, 20 minutes we should be in. Just walking in. The um, queue really didn't take that long. Probably about half an hour. Yeah. yeah, we're just walking in now. It is huge. So we just realised that it actually costs to get in here. <laughs> Another 24 euros, not each, all together. And you have to pay more if you want to take the lift. So we are walking up these stairs. It's like a little spiral. More stairs. A little bit of exercise. Let's do it. That was a trek. We're all we a bit all tired. Like, we all didn't like that very much at all. No, it why Ugh. get the lift. <laughs> it's two euros extra per person to get the lift. Yeah. We didn't realise how tall that was gonna be and we're all yeah. a bit unfit. <laughs> very unfit. That was so many stairs, it just kept going on and on <laughs> and on. <laughs> and guess what? We have more steps. <laughs> so me and Mum are terrified of heights. And we didn't realise this was height. This is very high. As you can see all the way down there. Nobody else wants to come in here but me. I don't care. And it's very, very high up there, but very beautiful. Extremely beautiful. <laughs> Some guy was pretty good with a paintbrush. So there we go. It's really not that bad. I thought it was going to be worse, but it's really, really not that bad. It felt like we walked up so much higher than this. I've got a little bit of jelly legs, but oh, and I feel a bit dizzy. <laughs> but it's amazing. You, you can't walk all the way up here and not see this. We weren't in there very long, but Mum had a bit of a situation, but she's all right now. We're on top of Rome. It's really, really cool. We just basically paid to go and be shit scared of heights. Cause me and mum are really, really scared of heights. And now we're gonna try and get back down again after about five minutes. So we just walked down the stairs and we've come out to where we were looking over and it's pretty incredible. It, everything is just so huge here. Amazing. Oh, we were up that level. Up there. That's, the level. that's where that's we were. That's how far that spirals. <laughs> we walked all the way up there. Doesn't look very big, but it is. It's, it's far enough. Yeah, it's far enough. <laughs> like... So we're leaving there now. <laughs> See the top of that dome. We walked up there. <laughs> Mum shat her pants <laughs> and cried. <laughs> but we're leaving here now. Bye. We have stopped for a very dessert, a little bit of a snack. It's probably like a late lunch because it's about four o'clock. I've gone for a tuna sandwich and a Coke. Mum's got a bit of pizza with some mushrooms on, and we've got two lattes, and I don't know what uh, Dad went for. Oh, here it is. Here we go. Nom nom nom. Nom 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 nom. <laughs> Busy as fuck. We went back to the hotel for a bit and then chilled and put a jacket and hat on because we were a little bit chilly. But now we've come out. We're going on an adventure to find an Irish pub. It's so been caught up by all the rich. Yes, it's I think it's, it's indulging. We found an Irish pub and we made some friends of Mancunians again and they were really lovely. And now we've ordered a pizza and and Prosecco! Cheers! Mm. Oh. But we have come to another little cafe area. Cafe Washington. And we've come to get more drinks. It's an alcoholic <laughs> Mum's gone for a cocktail. I've got a very large beer. A very large beer. I've just gone for a classic <laughs> wine of rosé. Lauren's trying to make out. She doesn't drink very much, but she's the worst one of the monsters. <laughs> yeah. I just got a small glass of rosé. Wow. And that's for you. Thank you. You're welcome. Fancy. My God, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> that was only 11 euros. Cocktail for Mama. Walking home from a bar crawl. These knobheads are wankered. Hey. Especially this one. Wobbly hat. <laughs> She's got a wobbly hat. What do you think of the situation? <laughs> a man falling over. It was hilarious. <laughs> A man fell over in front of us. And it was really funny, but then he told us he was a goalkeeper, so it was alright. And he also said, 
Never use your phone while walking. Yep, don't yeah. use your phone whilst walking.